everyone! My name is Daniela and I'm a Youth Services Librarian with Vaughn Public Libraries. You might recognize me from the Creation Lab, which is a program that runs Wednesday evenings at Woodbridge Library. During our closure, I'd like to show you how to bring the Creation Lab into your home. Today's project is a toilet paper race car. I found this activity on Primary Search, which is a database that you can access from our website with your library card. Primary Search is a searchable database geared specifically toward elementary school students, and it features popular magazines, encyclopedia entries, and images on a range of topics to help you with your homework assignments or just for fun. So today we're going to be taking a closer look at simple machines, and specifically wheels and axles. Wheels and axles work together in a rotating motion to help cars move on a variety of surfaces and to help them go really fast. Let me show you what you'll need for today's activity. You're gonna need one toilet paper roll, one straw, two toothpicks, four of these plastic lids, a hole punch, some decorative paper, a glue stick, and for adult use only, a craft knife, and a very sharp pair of scissors. So to begin, you're going to want to decorate your toilet paper roll. You can use acrylic paint, or as I did, you can cover it with some colored paper. I also decided to add some stripes, a number, some arrows, and a steering wheel. You can use any embellishments you have at home. Maybe you have some foam stickers or some glitter, anything that you have to make it special. While your child is working on decorating the body of the vehicle, you can work on the wheels. So you're gonna take a sharp pair of scissors or your craft knife and make a tiny hole right in the center of each of your four plastic lids. Once that's done, you can now take your straw and you're going to need two pieces that are slightly shorter than a toothpick. Next, Take your completed toilet paper roll and use your hole punch to make four holes, two toward the front and two toward the back end. Make sure that these are low enough on the toilet paper roll that when you assemble the vehicle, the wheels are able to touch the surface and lay flat. That's important. And you'll also want to make a hole in the very top for the seat of your passenger. Now all that's left to do is assemble it. So I have my completed roll here. I'm going to take one of my pieces of plastic straw and just feed it through the two holes at the back. And I'm going to do the same thing with my other piece of plastic straw and just push that through the two holes in the front. And then I'm going to take the toothpick and put one through the front and another through the back. I'm going to take my four wheels with the holes inside and with the top of the lid facing in, I'm going to attach that to the toothpick and do the same to the opposite side and the same to the back end as well. The exciting part about this activity is that your wheels should actually rotate when it's completed, which is really exciting. So all that's left to do now is find a passenger and start your engines. A car is a compound machine that is made up of hundreds of simple machines, including wheels and axles, inclined planes, levers, pulleys, and screws. You can learn more about simple and compound machines on World Book Online for Kids or primary search, which are databases that you can access through the library's website. Thank you for watching. We'd love to see your creations. Please use hashtag VPL at home for a chance to be featured on our social media channels. Please hit the like button and subscribe and stay tuned for more videos. Bye for now.